What is up, fam? Welcome back to Leslie Jones Tarot. This reading here is for my Pisces zodiac sign. This is your August reading. So, we're just going to kind of tap in and see what's going on for you in the month of August. So, guys, just remember this is a general reading, so this may not resonate. Energies are fluid and interchangeable, so they can cross. If you need to, please flip them. All right, we're going to do the modern witch deck. Let's see. Clarify the energy of Pisces. What is going on with Pisces for the month of August? Okay, what is going on with Pisces? What? What is that? What is that? The Hierophant. Okay. Oh, Two of Swords. All right. And, oh, okay. Five of Wands. Okay, whoa. Pisces. I see that you're kind of closed off, okay? The Hierophant. You're not trusting or you're not listening or committed to some type of higher energy right now you're, you're really focused i feel like you may be disconnected in the month of august and that may be why you're indecisive here or why you feel like you're in a could be a mental conflict that's keeping you confused right now because um I, and i'm not saying like you're saying i'm done with religion or i'm done with spirituality i just feel like you may be uh, blocked like your chakras may be blocked okay because we have the hierophant coming out in reverse and then we have the Two of Swords and the Five of Wands. So there's definitely some chaos going on in your mental that may have you a little blocked right now. And it could just be maybe you're overly focused here with the Eight of Pentacles. You could be really focused on your, your money, your finances, um, your stability here. And it kind of, um, you're kind of like zoned in. Okay, like uh, whatever this is that you're working on here. And this could be taking away or having you off balance here just a little bit where um, you're not able to connect to your higher self here. Okay. There, there's um, the Hierophant is also about like commitment, like higher commitment as well. So it's like you may not be open to that right now in the month of August. But we're going to see. Let's see what this. What about the energy of Pisces? What's going on with Pisces in the month of August? Yeah, there's a mental blockage. Okay, there's a mental blockage that's happening for you in the month of August. So there's a lot of uh, chaotic energy. It, you could just have a lot going on. And it could have to do with work. Okay, you could have a lot that's going on in work with that Eight of Pentacles coming out. And then the Eight of Swords. Okay, Eight, Eight. Make sure you're paying attention to your um, numbers here. But there could be a lot going on at work that may have you kind of off balance where you're not able to uh, connect. Like you don't have time to meditate. Um, you don't have time to like rest and, and um, do your rituals. Things like that is what I'm getting for you. Not that you're not wanting to. It's just you've been so busy or you've been so career focused that um, you haven't had time to sit down and like meditate and reconnect and align your chakras. Okay. You could be juggling a lot as well. Let's see. Clarify the Eight of Swords here for Pisces. For the month of August. 2021. The Justice card. Clarify the Eight of Swords for Pisces. Thank you. And the Queen of Wands. Yeah. Okay. So things are going to end up working out. Yeah. They're going to work out. The going into the month it may be a little chaotic because you're kind of everywhere in your mental like it's so much going on I don't know if there's some type of transition that's happening maybe at work maybe there's like a new position or something like that and you're trying to get used to it and you're really focused on that and you're trying to learn every in and out oh sorry guys I apologize but it's going to it, it's going to be fine okay everything's going to play out we have the justice card you're going to come back into balance here so that's fine you're going to come back into balance here, but and you're going to be refocused and realigned here because we have the uh, the Queen of Wands energy. So this could definitely be a, a new position that you're taking on that may kind of have things kind of chaotic. Or you could be um, starting some type of business in the month of August that may have you kind of like... Um, maybe I'm, I'm getting more like overwhelmed like you got so much going on in your mind that you don't have enough space <laughs> to like commit to sitting down and meditating and um praying it, 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 that's what i'm getting for you right now like the two of cups is here though so this is like your higher self your higher commitment so i feel like your your spiritual is what i'm getting for you i feel that your spiritual is just you got a lot going on 
on the outside. <laughs> and so on the inside, it's kind of blocked. Let's see. Give me, uh, give me one more. Tell me one more about Pisces for the month of August. What is going on in the month of August? The Knight of Pentacles. Okay, so really focusing on yourself, your stability. I do see money being okay for you in the month of August, so that's a good thing. The Star card, yeah. You need to take some time out and just make sure you're focusing on healing, focusing on resting, recuperating, okay? Making sure you're being optimistic, you're being positive. Don't let any negative um, energy affect you, okay? Don't take... Um, there could be a lot of uh, things that may be happening because we do have the Four of Cups here. And then the Empress. You are the Empress. Okay, remember that. You are the Empress, Pisces. You can do and create whatever it is that you put your mind to. You have the ability to do that. You are the Empress. Okay, so you can do it. So don't let things that may not be happening in your time that you're wanting them to or um, it's like you want something... The Empress is all about planting her seeds and sitting back and allowing them to grow. Sometimes it takes a little longer for things to happen. And you may be kind of chaotic and like all over the place because things aren't happening when you want them to. Because we have the Four of Cups. So you're just like, oh, this sucks. It's not happening when I want it to happen. But you have to remember to stay positive, stay optimistic, take some time to rest, take some time to regroup. Take some time to come back into balance, okay? And remember that the universe allows things to happen in due time all right and just know that it will happen but don't over obsess about it don't overthink about it or don't overwork yourself about it with this eight of swords energy like i'm getting more of like if it's finances you're like i need the money i need the money now i need the money i need the money now this needs to happen now when is this going to take off if it's like um a business you're opening up, you're like, I need the, I need somebody to shout me out. I need I need the business now. People need to find out who I am, what I'm selling, what it is that I got to offer. Just, you know, take a couple of breaths, all right, and just chill. All right, plant those seeds. Keep doing what you're doing in the background. You're doing good. You're on the right track, okay? Nine of Pentacles. You're on the right track. <laughs> oh, that came out country. <laughs> you're on the right track. So just keep doing that and don't... um over it over obsess about the outcome just live in the present okay who okay that's what I'm getting for you all right my goodness <laughs> I'm sorry guys I'm hoping that I'm really hoping this is making sense here it's like I feel like you're losing faith because it's not happening like right now right now but you just need to realign and just be like okay you know what things do happen in due time and I just need to breathe set back i've planted the seeds keep doing what i'm doing focusing okay and it will come to me let's see what other messages do you have for pisces for the month of august 2021 what other messages do you have for pisces for the month of august 2021 what other messages do you have for pisces in the month of august 2021. Thank you. What other messages do you have for Pisces? Thank you. All right. So your messages are number 15, adrift in shallow water. Take a few deep breaths and reconnect to your inner peace. I just, just freaking said that. Yes. <laughs> number 15, adrift in shallow water. Take a few deep breaths and reconnect to your inner peace. Notice the small things and appreciate them. Oh my goodness, I just said that, but they just said it better, okay? Look at that. Remember, okay, it's going to be okay. It's going to be okay. Don't let, don't let it cause you to go freaking crazy because it will happen. Just, again, stay in the present and be like, okay, I'm doing the work. I'm doing whatever it is that needs to happen. And know that things will happen in due time, okay? Continue to be the empress. Uh, uh, plant those seeds, you know, water them. Yeah, like, for example, let me give you an example. YouTube, right? Say you want to get on YouTube and you're like, oh, I want to hit, I want to start making money off of YouTube. I got to get 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 watch hours, right? And you're like, okay, I got, I got 3,000 watch hours. I need to hurry up and get the rest. What's going on? What's going on? And you're like over-focusing on it, right? So you're like panicking about it. You're stressing about it. You got yourself all worked up. Nothing's happening. Okay. Just keep doing what you're doing, right? 
do the videos, upload the videos. It will come when it's meant to, okay? And then we have um, number 23, distinctive potential. Rely on your faith and the knowledge that nothing is impossible. Use your determination to hang in there until you realize a goal, all right? I couldn't have said it better. I love it when the cards basically repeat what I'm saying. <laughs> I love it. Rely on your face. So that means take a few minutes out, realign yourself and realize that, okay, I don't have to overwork myself or overthink or do anything extra. I'm doing what I'm supposed to be doing. Let me keep sticking to that. Okay, let me stick to the schedule. Let me get this done, get this done, get this done. I'm doing the work. Okay, it will pay off in due time. All right. So what last message do you have for Pisces? Well, we're going to pull, let's pull your fortune rating and then we'll pull uh, a star seed. Perfect. Thank you. Hmm. You are not going to believe the card. Look at, look at what popped out. Devil. Take care immediately to avoid temptation and deceit. See, I've, I'm, I'm getting the feeling that you're, you're trying to worry more about like the outcome or worry more about the future instead of enjoying the present moment. And just and when you do that, it becomes devilish type energy where it's like overly obsessive, you know, over worrying, over stressing. Don't do that. Just know that you're confident in what you're doing and that you're doing the right things and that it will eventually pay off. You know, just you got to have patience. OK, I, th I think that's what it is. Have patience. All right. And then we also have lovers. There are two paths ahead. Be true to yourself. OK, be true to yourself, which is choosing to continue to work and believe in yourself and knowing that you'll have the ability to create whatever it is that you want. Or you can go down this road of overly obsessing, being chaotic and continue to be every which way. You know, just take your time. Things will work out. I promise. What other messages do you have for Pisces? Perfect. We have creation. Being creative is a wonderful way of witnessing the unfolding of your limit, limitless creative soul. Okay, so continue to use that creativity and knowing that that is what you have to offer. Okay, that Queen of Wands energy. Earth God, your sacred calling upon this planet is to simply love and be loved so beautiful so this is your reading for the month of august pisces i hope this gives you some clarity and some insight guys i appreciate you so much for watching and we'll catch you guys in the next video bye guys